What's up guys, my name is Akordidi and welcome back to another Photoshop tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add that beautiful shine to your images in Photoshop without breaking a single sweat with these simple steps. I got a couple of people asking me how I add the shine to my images so I decided to make this video to show you guys how I do it. So without further ado, let's jump straight into Photoshop and let's start editing. Alright, after you finish editing your image, after you finish adding your frequency separation, you finish coloring and all the stuff. Or when you like, you can do it without even coloring or you can do it before you color. But I mostly like to do it after I color my images, right? Anyhow you do it, it's up to how you want it. So, right. So I'm going to um, hide the first one that I did over here. So if I'm going to go here and then create a new curves adjustment layer. I'm going to name this burn or shine yeah then I'm gonna drag this handle up like this and then I'm gonna hide this then I'm gonna change the blend mode to luminosity like this as you can see the image is looking white all right then secondly you're gonna come here and then double click so this is gonna pull up this blend if panel over here so this is where we're gonna do or this is where we're gonna work our magic at so with the um, slider to the left we're gonna move it to the right like this so you're gonna move it and then as you can see the image is changing so we're gonna move it till you see that the highlights in the image are selected then afterwards you're gonna hold alt and then click here to split the slider then now we're gonna drag the right handle to the right a little bit like this yes so you see that the highlights are standing out all the highlights are selected all right, so let me bring it back a bit and then let's do it again. All right, so this blends the effect onto the image. So we're gonna move this a little bit back like this, back and forth. Let's play around with the sliders so you get everything looking perfect or looking like you want it. So we're gonna move this slider a little bit backwards like this too. Yeah, I think, okay, let's keep it here. You know, let's just play with this once depending on every image and then how the effect is going to apply on it so you got to pay attention to that all right so i think this is quite okay for me so let's go to okay and check the before and after so this is the before and then this is the after so what we're going to do next is we're going to select the layer mask over here and then press alt and i to invert all right so now we're going to select the brush tool Increase the size like this and then change the foreground color to white by pressing X and then we're going to paint over. Make sure your brush is uh, the soft front brush is selected like this and then just brush onto the face or the parts that you want to apply the shine on like this into her face zoom out a little bit to check how strong the effect is appearing on the image now let's zoom in again so let's check the before and after this is the before and this is the after so if you think the effect is too much you're just gonna decrease the opacity a little bit like this let's just keep it at 100 and now let's check the blend if again so we're gonna just fine-tune it if you think the effect is not okay for you or you want it a little bit to blend in to the image more you're just gonna play around with a slider over here and fine-tune it just like this Yeah. 
so on this image i think this effect is okay for me so i'm gonna keep it like this so if um the effect is too much for you you're just gonna come to the opacity and then just drag it back decrease the opacity just to make it look more natural so that's simply how you just add this shine to it so there's another method as well that i normally love to add as well to the image so i'm going to come here and then select on selective color and then change the colors to white and then on the black slider i'm going to move it a little bit back like this as you can see the image is shining even more so let's check the before and after this is the before and this is the after so i'm going to zoom out the same way i did this one i can choose to copy this um, adjustment layer and then apply it onto the selective color adjustment layer or you can select it press ctrl and i to invert and then with the brush selected i'm going to change it to the foreground color to white and i'm just going to paint over the eyes hey, sorry i'm just going to paint over the face to make the effect only appear on where i paint And there you have it having your shine on your image. So I'm gonna press and then I'm gonna put this into a group. And then let's check the before and after. This is the before and this is the after. This is the before and this is the after. So if you like your effects, then you're just gonna keep it like that. I think it's okay, I like this. So I'm gonna keep it like that. If you like this video, kindly get me to at least 100 like and don't forget to subscribe to this channel as well and you can check the description i have a group that i would like you to join so that we can have a conversation over there and then you can check my online store as well and support me by buying a couple of stuff you get me just to keep me going right so see you guys in the next video goodbye for now